Welcome back everyone. Welcome back to our everyday living. We um, have finally moved into the house. Still got a few things to go in there. Uh, we've been in there for probably going on nearly a week now. Um, but uh, anyway, that's not what I'm here to talk about. I'm here to actually let you know that I'm going to be doing the bit of donating. Uh, I've got a bag here that we've rustled up that um, from our last outing um, and we're going to donate that and we've got a whole heap of cans, cartons, plastic to do on a follow-up. So let's go and put this all through. I've got the barrow here so I can actually get this one off here because it's full of glass. So yeah, going to be a bit heavy. But I thought, well, while I've got the barrow, I might go and have a look at Harvey Norman and see what they've got. So we might do that as well. All depends on time frame. See so here we go. So let's go to get it all done, I suppose. over there waiting get all the cans through first got a train waiting over here yeah, take it home with you mate works better right yo get these done then we'll go and do a looky at Harvey good old Harvey and Norman scan that in scan that away Put that up there, yeah, typical. Gets caught straight off, look at that. There we go. I'm gonna do these, because these take longer. Got more of. Got another chappy that's coming beside me.
I'll take him home, take them home and crush them up. Well, this might be another one. Yep. Another one there. I know you go through. What's wrong with you? Go over gas. Yeah, that'll be it. No, nope. what's wrong with you? Give you a clean. Give you a rub. Rub the bottle with the genie. No, still don't want to go through. We've got nothing that I can put on it. Let's speed up. That's a dirty thing to do, though. What else am I supposed to do? Give it another rub. See here we go. No, still no good. Come on. Rub the bottle, rub the bottle. Give me 10 cents. Nope. <laughs> Doesn't seem to want to go. What a rip off. What a rip off. Oh, put him up there. I want the machine to foul up. There's another one of those pinkies. Another one that won't go through. Get a lot of those.
Oh, 50. Someone must be must have lit a fire where they shouldn't have. That's up to the trouble. Certainly not this black duck. Are <laughs> <laughs> oh, you just ready? <laughs> I'm a witness for that. Come on, go through. If those up and go ones won't go through, sometimes it's a double layer of plastic over the barcode. Yeah. So you pull one along and a lot of plastic off. Come on, don't do that to me. I blow them up with a neck compressor. You only need a little mm. bike. Pump even. Like the bike, the, the basketball nozzle. In a bike pump. One foot and they're, they're open. up at the uh
Well, what'd you do? Oh, going too quick for it. <laughs> oh, come on. You'll read. You're gonna read. I want you to read. Nope. Go that way then. Come on. Go through. You've scanned. Come on. Go bye byes. Go bye byes. Go bye byes. Go bye byes. Come on. I can't put another one in until it goes bye byes. <laughs> come on. Get past that section. Come on, get going, get going. Hey! <laughs> no matter how squashed they are, as long as they go to buy a shake. You read the barcode, then it goes by shake. I'll burp burp you. Pull it out. Thank you. Speed up, bro. Come on.
Oh, what the devil? I must have took too long. Oh, that one will go there. Got a label inside. I'll take him home. Thank you. Check the bullshit. Hate it when it has this. The love hate relationship with these machines. <laughs> I'm putting it through, but I hate getting it out. What? Well, I don't mind getting it out. If you know what I mean. Now you got a technical issue with it. That's the hate part of it. Only nothing wrong with you. Go through. That's another one of those ones, I think. Yep, that's the same candidate as that one. Yeah, another one of those pinky ones. It's starting to come through. Fair enough.
the ground. Another one of those. See him up there. Someone else will get him. Got our glass to go after this. Shooting it through like a robot. <laughs> oh, that's another one of those. Sit that up there.
Is that one yours, love? Oh, no, it's not yours. Oh, well, I'll get it to you anyway. <laughs> I'm finished with the plastic and glass.
don't. Oh, I saved it. <laughs> I saved it. Saved the day. Well, I just about slipped back out of my hands again. Oh, you would do that. Get a few more out of here and we'll pour it into the smaller tub. I reckon that's the geo. Put another one in, another one there. Nah. Too heavy. Just too heavy. I went away from bags for, for the glass, it was getting too heavy. Oh, baloney. You go through. Then you go through. Bend over. <laughs> Think smarter, not harder. Well, the thing goes, work smarter, not harder. I think I've just done that. Work smarter. Didn't break any. Just good. Or did I? I did. Got a victim. Oh, there we go. All right, let's go and find out how much we got. Well, unfortunately, they don't have anything behind the bins where I can pick it up. And that's where they've been putting it. Never mind. Go and do our part. All right, put this in our charity. Always love giving the charity. Salvation Army. Good fellas. There we go. Right. Well, it's not as much as I thought it might be, but at least we put it through. That's the main thing. And I am seeing a lot more roadside. Like I'm talking about people stripping wash machines out on the road on the on, in the streets and leaving the carcass that's just wrong if you want the wash machine take the whole thing don't leave it behind you want them you want the part of the big recycling and not just grab copper you got to take the whole thing don't leave all the plastic behind don't leave all the steel behind just don't just go for the copper wire and all of that that's i find that is just absolute ludicrous there is money in steel so take the steel as well uh, just doing a drive-by today and I found well I didn't pick them up I found two wash machines a fridge all stripped out the motor was gone in the fridge the copper was gone and I thought that's just wrong if you want the thing take the whole thing don't just leave it in, in, in the street for the street to be dirty but anyway, getting off that subject, uh, we put through 170, oh the damn phone, bear with me for a second everyone, $179.50, so 
so that's 1795 units not too bad not too bad I thought it would have been more it looked like more especially with us having the wool pack on and you know the back of the vehicle fully loaded probably if we went a little bit more if I thought was able to find more I would have probably top the $200 mark but it did look like over the $200 mark probably because of all of the big items like the two litre bottles and that sort of thing that they take up a lot of room so that's where it varies on how much you actually can get like one two litre bottle can take up at least three small cans three small uh, plastic bottles water bottles so that's where it takes up a lot of extra room and you think you got that extra over the $200. But anyway, if you've enjoyed tagging along with this one everyone, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. And uh, if you consider subscribing, don't forget to hit the notification bell. Uh, that way you get notified when there's a new video coming out. And yes, I have, a hair have, I have had a haircut. Uh, got sick of the hot weather. I usually do it every three months. I'm a bit overdue but anyway never mind about me uh, we put a fair through fair bit through in our recycling uh, nothing at Harvey Norman today so $179.50 that's pretty get damn good so on that note everyone I ended off there I've had my my little bit of a insight on a um, bit of curbside picking up um, so yeah please if you're out there take the whole unit don't leave it on the side. Till next time, cheerio.